This is Kajol Jadav and I am here to explain daily current affairs for UPSC Civil Services exam. Vaccine against cervical cancer should not be introduced in India's immunization plan. Why? India should think twice before introducing HPV vaccine in India's immunization plan. What is HPV vaccine? How will it be administered in India? Does every girl need to be vaccinated against human papilloma virus infection? What is human papilloma virus? How deadly is it? GS Paper 2 Issues related to health, education and human resources In this video, you can find detailed answers for all the above questions. The above article has been retrieved from the Indian Express newspaper dated December 14, 2017. What is the context about? A national technical advisory group on immunization has proposed that a vaccine against the human papilloma virus which causes cervical cancer be introduced in India's Universal Immunization Program UIP. The medical community in India, however, remains divided over the vaccine's universal implementation. The Swadeshi Jagran Manch asked Prime Minister Narendra Modi to stall moves to incorporate HPV vaccination in the UIP, saying it would divert scarce resources from more worthwhile health initiatives to a vaccine of doubtful utility. Why India should think twice before introducing HPV vaccine in India's immunization plan? In India, the primary concern is cost, given the huge population and stretched healthcare budgets. A single shot of Gardasil costs approximately Rs 3000 and Sarvarix about Rs 2000. Each girl requires three shots. At present, no data suggests that either Gardasil or Sarvarix can prevent invasive cervical cancer as the testing period is too short to evaluate the long-term benefits of HPV vaccination. At three shots of Gardasil at MRP of 6.2 crore Indian girls aged 9 to 13 years, the cost to the government will be over Rs 56,000 crores. Thus, it would divert scarce resources from more worthwhile health initiatives to vaccine of doubtful utility. What is HPV vaccine? How will it be administered in India? The HPV vaccine is given thrice within six months to girls aged 9 to 13 years before they become sexually active. In India, two vaccines, Merck's Gardasil and GlaxoSmithKline's Cervarix are available. Cervarix provides immunity against HPV subtypes 16 and 18. Gardasil protects against subtypes 16 and 18 as well as against 6 and 11, which cause 90% of genital warts in men and women. Post-vaccination, a girl should ideally undergo pap smear test every three years to check for precancerous or cancerous cells. Does every girl need to be vaccinated against human papilloma virus infection? The answer is a resounding yes. HPV vaccine is recommended for girls ages 9 to 13 years and three doses protect them against HPV infections that cause genital warts and cervical cancer. Recurrent HPV infection, which is transmitted sexually, is a cause for cervical cancer. Cervical cancer is the second most common cancer in the woman worldwide, 
sickening 5,10,000 women and killing 2,88,000 each year. In India, 1,32,000 new cervical cancer cases and 74,000 deaths occur each year, with Indian women facing a 2.5% cumulative lifetime risk and 1.4% cumulative death risk from cervical cancer. What is human papillomavirus? How deadly is it? HPV is a group of viruses known to cause penile cancer in men and cervical, vaginal, anal and vulva cancer in women. HPV can also lead to throat or rectum cancer in both men and women. The virus is transmitted through intimate contact, for instance, via sexual intercourse, oral or anal sex. The HPV subtypes 16 and 18, which causes over 70% of cervical cancer cases, produce two protein which turn off tumor suppressing genes and lead to abnormal growth in the cervical lining. While infection may not always lead to cervical cancer, the virus poses a higher risk for HIV infected persons, smokers, those with high dependency on hormonal contraceptives and with early initiation into sexual activity.